Hey everyone, it's me, so and today I have I've had these for a while actually and these are the scary tales line. I know I told you guys that I weren't gonna get them, but the quality of the dolls that I found were actually pretty amazing. They weren't as bad as the rest that I saw, so I thought I'd get them. So yeah, we're gonna get started. So we're gonna bring up little dead riding wolf. So this is the packaging. I'm sorry that you can see the glare again, that really bugs me. But yeah, um, there we go, this is better. So there she is, it says, Once upon a time there was a ghoul with a nose for travel. And it says, Scarily ever after. And there's like purple cobwebs and stuff. It's supposed to look like a book apparently, because up here it's got like lines. And yeah, and this is the back of it. You can pause if you want to read it. But I suck at reading, so yeah. And just near the bottom it's got the other two. And then it has this the proof of purchase code. So yeah, that is Little Dead Riding Wolf. And then Snow Bite, which is my absolute favourite. Packaging is basically the same, it's just her in a box. And then the side lo it looks like the book, Scarily Ever After. And then if I keep this here for a while, you guys can read it. Um, so yeah, if you pause, you can read it. She's definitely my favourite. She's always been my favourite character out of all of them. Then Frederetta. Arilla? Oh, I apologise. This little thing says, Once upon a time there was a ghoul whose beauty fairly reflected her heart. Yeah, that's what that says. This one says, Once upon a time there was a ghoul who wished for more. And this is Threadarilla. Same thick sort of thing. Looks like a book. And then this is the back. You can pause what it says again. Okay, so they are fully deboxed now. This is them, um, like, fully deboxed. And they're all the same height, but it's just that the boxes aren't level, I think. And Dracula's, Dracula's legs are bent. So, yeah. Start off, we're going to do a little dead riding wolf. So... This is her book, and it basically um, has a story on it, um, hopefully you guys can see. If you pause it and read it, um, yeah, I think you guys should pause it and read it yourself, because I suck at reading. And then at the end it says, and they lived scarily ever after. So that's that. I've read it, it's actually quite good. Um, so that's that. They all come with the same black brushes, which I normally just keep in my Monster Hydro, which is basically all the extras and stuff. So yeah. Um, this is her. I'm not too sure about the stand, to be honest. I really don't like it. I mean, like, what's the point of doing it transparent and then leaving the bottom bit black? Like, might as well have done it all black or done it all transparent. I just don't see what's the point of that. But, yeah. I'll take her off the stand. Okay. So, I'm going to start off with her shoes. Her shoes are quite hard plastic. They've got little gold buckles on and they're basically just purple. Um, Okay. Let's start with the bag as well. The bag is just a little black basket with a little gold buckle on. It does open. You flip it like this. So it opens one side and another side, which is cool. I like that. Um, her dress is red. It's like satin material. It's quite shiny. It's quite soft. And it's got like a corset bit down the bottom, which is black. And she's got these two little gold bones. 
and then purple sh like what is that like ribbon with a fake gold buckle going down I like the petticoat underneath it's just netting I think that's really I think that makes it it makes it more like better and then she's got purple silky sleeve with a little bit little bit of black netting um, so I'm gonna lift her hair up and show you all the way around her hair is very soft this is her little updo she's like pinned it back it's got red I'm liking the red with Claudine I think red really suits her I love her makeup I think it's super dramatic and dark and I love it it's purple and glittery it's like a purple smoky eye and black with a glitter highlight above the brow bone red juicy lips with her teeth and yeah this is her dress and I really love this style I think it's superb yet again she's got four earrings two on each side then this this was what I was debating whether I liked it and I do like it got a little buckle here and this is her little hood she's got two little holes for her ears to go in and then this this was this was the bit that was troubling me because I didn't know if I liked it I didn't know if it was a bit tacky or not but I still haven't made my mind up it's just glittery cheetah parent kind of thing it's all glitters it's really nice but I just thought it was I just don't know but then when I realised I put it on her which I will show you I've just buckled her up buckled it on there she does actually look pretty cute with her on so I'm going to try and put her ears on it to see how good it is ok so I'm just showing you guys so the holes fit quite perfect actually I actually prefer it like that but I'm still not too keen on this bit I would prefer that to go on the back as well but it's not really weird hiding hood is it I don't know I do like her I think she's really cool overall so yeah but I definitely prefer her little hood thing to the way it was originally with her hair out and it on the side so how she was deboxed deboxed so hang on so yeah I prefer her like this kind of thing obviously more of her hair yeah I prefer her like this overall I think it's a very beautiful doll and I'm glad I got her so yeah I'm going to do the rest now so that's Claudine I'm just going to place her down okay then Snow Bite, which is my favourite. This is the front. Like I said, you can pause it and read it if you really want to. I just love the work. I really do love their work on these three dolls. Like their artwork is amazing. And then this. Let me move my finger so you can. Hang on, guys. There you go. So you can fully read it. Then the other page. I've read this one too. I read them quick before I made this, like, before I showed you them. But they're, they're really good. Says, and they live scared ever after again. I just think the little books, the proper books, are really good. So here's Snow Bite. Yeah, her legs are bent. Okay, so take her off her stand again. Okay, so this is what she comes with it's like a little dripping heart. Heart? I mean, apple, like a heart apple. That's what I was going for. Little handle, it's plastic, it's see through, it's transparent, whatever you want to say. It does open, I think. I'm sure it, yes, it opens. So you can fit something in there. It's something obviously small because of the width. But yeah, that's the apple. Um, okay, so starting with her shoes again, I'm going to put her legs straight. Shoes are amazing. They're like 
dripping little hearts at the back with the little stems then a pink bow and then a black lots of netting under her dress which I'm loving and then it's got loads and loads of apples and skulls on the on this bit of the dress which is goes all the way around it's pink and it's green and it's black I'm loving this it's like drippy bit loving the bow so I'm really bad at describing but you guys can see it pretty clearly um, she's got pink underneath her hair which I'm loving 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 pink and green are my, both of my favourite colours that's why I was adamant getting this doll her little plastic little hair clip she's actually got a dripping necklace um, her makeup is amazing I really want to do a tutorial on this it's like yellow to green to darker green and then the beautiful like vampy burgundy lips and I don't know if you guys have realised this but her heart on her cheek like yeah yeah cheek and heart on the heart on her cheek is got like green on it it's supposed to be like a little dripping I don't know I think it's supposed to be like the apple like dripping bit of apple I'm not sure if it's just on my doll but yeah it looks pretty cool I think so yeah and she's got little jelly green earrings that you can't tell but they're the same as the bag and the hair clip and yeah I'm loving her yeah again sm really smooth hair really beautiful my favourite one out of all of them to be honest um, I don't know if you guys have realised but it's just they're just so they're different their clothes are different and I think this is in a good way because it, they look like it's been more handmade other than all the other dolls that are quite fitting and quite teenagery and quite chic but these I just feel like these because it's got netting on it makes it look more like realistic and like it's really hard to explain I'm really sorry but yeah loving her I best start chatting more because I don't know if this video is going to let me do it so yeah Threadarella you can read it if you really want to. Did I do that bit? I think I did that bit, didn't I? I can't remember. And then I'm loving this Abby doll. I hope they do Abby like that as a doll. So it's so get it. And then at the end. And then, and they live scared over after. Sorry, I'm rushing with her. It's just, I only have a 15 minute limit now on YouTube. So, yeah. Her little sewing needle bag. I'm not sure if it opens. Oh, okay, it does open. It's quite tight. Opens like that. It's just a red little sewing needle bag. Her shoes are like scissors, lace-ups with the pin on it. You can basically tell what she's doing. This is like, I'm not sure what this is supposed to be, but it's like puffy material and then netting and then puffy material again. She's only got, she hasn't actually got any netting, it's just puffy from the material. So I'm just, just spinning her around and it's all shiny and red. And then this bit, I love the one-off shoulder of her. Her makeup is really nice. It's silver and blue. And she's got little pin nails. I'm liking her little tiara. It's got scissors and pins and needle and thread kind of thing. Her hair is cool. I'm loving this little like curly style. Overall, I think she's really good as well. I love them all, to be honest. I... Like when I first saw them, I thought their quality was really bad. But now I've love, I love, 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 love them. Thanks for watching this video. Sorry, I've had to fasten it up and really edit it loads. But yeah, I had to get it all in. And yeah, thank you for watching, guys. Bye.